A confident Elon Musk walked to a podium in Australia earlier this month to promote the benefits of a deal. I think this is this is definitely the way of the future. That would make the state of South Australia home to the world's largest renewable energy storage battery. It would also raise the Tesla co-founder's profile as a renewable energy conscious entrepreneur. This deal is actually going to be incredibly helpful um, in, in, within Australia and around the world um, as a proof point for being able to do large scale utility battery applications. The deal involves building a lithium ion battery, which has become a common way to power most of our mobile devices. But this one would be the world's largest, and the sun's getting a responding goal. occupying roughly the size of a football field to store energy generated from a nearby wind farm. It's simply a matter of scaling up. Uh, they're just going to have the same battery unit multiplied many uh, dozens of times so that uh, you just array them uh, in, the, in the area and connect them all up, a bit like solar panels. Musk has offered to build it in 100 days or he'll cover the multi-million dollar price tag. Details of the exact costs haven't been released. There are uh, challenges just in terms of getting that the logistics coordinated. It's not rocket science, uh, although Elon Musk dabbles in that as well. Uh, it's, but there are some technical challenges, but they're not particularly unusual for the, the energy sector in terms of the scale of those challenges. More importantly, the project could help add stability to South Australia's ailing energy system, highlighted by a statewide blackout last year following damaging storms. Australia is home to the world's largest interconnected electricity system, which serves a population roughly the same size as Beijing. The problem with that is that an energy system being so large to supply so few people means that the cost has to be shared among a smaller group of people. Which is one of the reasons why Australians pay some of the highest energy prices in the world. Experts don't expect the lithium-ion battery deal to change that. It will provide an extra reserve of renewable energy for South Australia when needed. But experts say a successful project has the potential to impact the global push toward greater reliance on renewable energy. Certainly, once one is built, we would hope that others follow. Uh, we'd also hope that it, it opens up the dialogue around what we can do in our energy system to extend beyond just the simple generation of energy. The project is expected to be completed by December. Greg Navarro, CGTN, Sydney.